Hi, my name is Mira as a student in Faculty of Business and Management. Today, my friends and I are here to share about Go Green Campus. Our aim is to raise awareness about protections and conservations of the environment among students, lecturers and staff at the University College. Over the past few decades, our planet has been destroyed and exploited by serious environmental issues that cause serious natural resources depletions of ecosystem, habitat, wildlife and others. In fact, the top three global environmental issues in the current phenomena are climate change, global warming and air pollution. Perhaps recently Malaysia is facing environmental issue due to escalating carbon dioxide emissions. To overcome this challenge, many tertiary institutions in Malaysia are stepping up initiatives to conserve the environment such as University Putra Malaysia having a green mandate in place that aligns campus activities. Besides, the International School Kuala Lumpur in Ampang Hilly won gold medal reward due to their building were built with green environment concept. Thus, it is important to understand about green campus especially in institutions. Green campus is a place for environmental friendly practices and educations combined to promote sustainability in the campus. As we know, our Southern University College haven't taken any initiative to promote green campus to raise awareness among the lecturers, staff and students. Therefore, our group has conducted a campaign named Go Green Campus to raise the awareness. I think this is the right time for Southern University College to practice more on the green campus environment. Therefore, as part of our Green Campus initiative at Southern University College, we have formed two groups to execute our own individual ideas. For Group 1, we had a waste paper collection booth set up in the campus for five days. Through this initiative, we successfully collected a total of 166 kilograms of waste papers from Southern University staff, lecturers and students. Finally, the collected waste papers were sold to waste paper recycler. Besides, we had organized one workshop and about five students joined this activity. Through this workshop, Students were given an opportunity to learn the techniques to plant and manage their own potted plants. Overall, we believe that these activities have created awareness among staff, lecturers and students on the right methods of sorting and recycling papers and ultimately on how to incorporate it into their daily lives. For Group 2, our activities were split into two weeks. For the first week, our team set up booths and sold reusable items such as metal straws and recycle bags. The net profit were then used to purchase potted plants which we then donated to the university. For the second week, our members set up booths in the two main canteens to offer free drinks and snacks to individuals who brought their own Tupperware or recycle bags to pack their food. This was done with the intention that our effort would motivate thousand UC staffs, lecturers and students to bring their own containers or recycle bags to pack their food as well as to reduce the usage of plastic containers and plastic bags in our campus. By the end of week 2, we observed that about 28 individuals brought their own containers or recycle bags. This observation proved the success of our team in promoting Go Green Campus at Southern UC. Through our activities, we have helped to reduce the overall usage of plastic on our campus. Overall, Southern University should have the right method to save energy, water and other natural resources. Therefore, here I would like to recommend the following method to reduce the negative effect of environmental problem. Lecturer and students should reduce the use of paper by less printing teaching materials. Moreover, the lecturer can reduce paper by printing the teaching materials by using recycled paper so that the paper can be fully utilized. Besides, e-learning and mobile learning are more effective methods for green campus. Strong commitment by top management. Better electricity system in the classroom to avoid more electricity usage. First, turn off light, air conditioner, fans if it not usable. The management of Southern UC should provide a DIY recycle bin campaign and encourage students to participate in Go Green Campus. Plan to plant more trees surrounding campus area. Canteen and store in Southern UC is one of the most important parties in protecting environment within the campus. They should avoid using plastic bag, polish string or plastic packaging and plastic utensils such as plastic fork and spoon to customer. 
They will motivate students, staff and lecturers to bring their own utensil and usable bag. For toilet, it can suggest to have an auto wash hand sensor and auto flush tank to reduce waste of water. It also can install sensor in the toilet that will automatically shift off the light once if no people around in the toilet for a specific period of time. As a conclusion, with a focus on environment, students are offered a future-oriented education. All people on campus are united by special green feeling that inspire teaching, learning and working. Go Green Campus!